Hello, this is Bridget, and I'm back with our bracelet, and this time, instead of just soldering on something onto the bracelet, which I just soldered a charm on, we're going to do some dangles. To do a dangle, you're going to take a jump of... Hello, this is Bridget, and I'm back with our bracelet, and this time, instead of just soldering on something onto the bracelet, which I just soldered a charm on, we're going to do some dangles. To do a dangle, you're going to take a jump, um, hello, this is Bridget. Um, we're going to continue on with our bracelet after we've soldered it and we've soldered a charm on. Now we're going to add some dangles. To do a dangle, we're going to start with a head pin. Um, you can add anything you want to your head pin. So I'm going to add a little silver bead and a little Swarovski crystal and another bead and another crystal. So I've made this little um, dangle here like this. We're now going to use a round um, pliers. It's completely round and it's got the best ones are going to have a really tiny fine end. I'm going to take the pliers and grasp it just a hair above the top bead. I'm going to twist backwards so laying it flat, then I'm going to flip my head pin back over. This effectively makes a loop at the top. I'm going to then take that loop and put it over a jump ring. Holding it firmly against the jump ring, I'm going to take the tail and turn it parallel to my pliers until you like where it's at on the actual um, head pin. Last but not least, we're going to cut the excess off, resulting in a nice dangle with a wrapped head pin. I guess that does it for our dangles and our um, soldering. If you like this, come back again. We're going to do a lot more jewelry. 